Did you know that an area larger than China is used to grow food that is never eaten? And that is the truth. Terrible, but truth. Today I'm going to tell you about the Good Food Project. Our project was developed within the framework of the YSP Peace Designer Program, dedicated to the United Nations Sustainable Development Goals. It was designed by our team of university and high school students. It is directly related with the 12th of the UN SDGs, which is responsible consumption and production. Within the framework of this goal, several areas of work can be distinguished. We have chosen the direction related to the rational use of food. Nowadays, the problem of food waste is widespread. 1.3 billion tons of food is thrown away annually in the world. And this is despite the fact that more than 800 million people in the world suffer from hunger. In Russia, more than 18 million tons of food is thrown away annually, and the number of hungry people exceeds 1 million. One of the solutions to this problem is food sharing. Food sharing is the practice of distributing expiring, but not yet expired, overproduced food between members of the society using special organizations and online platforms. The idea of our project is to become some kind of intermediaries between organizations that provide food, cafes, restaurants, as we call them, up organizations, and companies that distribute food to people, for example, to the poor people, lower organizations. Our primary strategy was as follows. Study in detail the direction of food sharing in Russia, arrange a meeting to define more specific steps for our project, find organizations that like distributing food, cafes, restaurants, up organizations, find organizations like um, distributing food to the homeless, low organizations, and bring together or unite these two kind of organizations, lower and upper ones. As a part of our study of this direction, in addition to reading various articles, or together with YSP Russia, we held the conference Save the Food, Prospects for the Development of Food Sharing in Russia. At this conference, we managed to learn the experience of leading Russian organizations in the Russian food sharing business. Four speakers represented large organizations, for example, Food Bank Russia, Food Sharing Moscow, and others, we were able to get into contact with them and in the future there will be an opportunity to cooperate with these companies. This meeting also brought together many local food sharing organizations and uh, a lot of university and high school students. YSP proclaimed a resolution which we signed promising to support the Save the Food movement and introduce responsible consumption into our daily lives. Also, we managed to get into contact with the organization that distributes food for the homeless and we helped them distribute the food. Due to these programs, we found out that a huge problem that Russian food sharing faces is the Russian legislation. It is more beneficial for cafes and restaurants right now just to utilize waste products instead of um, giving it to charity. Therefore, as long as the legislative draft is still not in force, we decided to move forward to raising awareness among the Russian youth about responsible consumption. We will do it by sharing posts on social networks and by holding more conferences. Also, we are planning to sign petitions in favor of enacting legislation. In addition to that, as a part of our project, we will cooperate with Russian food sharing organizations. There is one more idea that is supporting a rational use of food, and that is so-called local kitchen. The concept is sharing homemade food that you cannot eat and either way throw away among the neighbors. Our original strategy about collaboration with upper and lower organizations will be effective only when the legislation changes. Until that, we will try to find organizations which are willing to pay more if needed. Yet, we will focus more on their enlightenment. In the nearest future, we plan to organize a meeting with the youth who took part in our conference and who are interested in the food sharing problem to define more specific steps and find out what is the most relatable and suitable plan for our further work. Now, nowadays, now, right now, as the results of for 
2021, we want to see first 300 youth followers in Instagram, 100 participants conference, 100 people who share the resolution of responsible consumption that YSP proclaimed, at least three cooperative projects with Russian food sharing organizations, and a start and active work of local kitchens in three districts. Our project starts on a local level, but we will continue to develop. This is the idea of our project. Thank you for your attention. Thank you.